I had first non-payer since I introduced my new method of pushing them to pay. I knew it's gonna happen someday. Hello again and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Polish Pete, I'm eBay, eBay reseller based in UK. I buy cheap ladies clothing in bulk and I sell them individually on eBay for profit. I've got another what sold video for you today, but before we start, if you're interested in this kind of content, please consider subscribing to the channel. So guys, fifth week in a row above uh, 500 pounds, which is smashing. Uh, if we take into consideration the low quality of stock that I've got at the moment, it's absolutely smashing. Uh, we had very, very, very good weekend. We've done uh, almost 300 pounds during Saturday and Sunday. Uh, we had very, very poor two days uh, during the week. I think it was Tuesday when we took like 15 quid and Thursday when we took like 30 quid. But that weekend pushed us over that 500 pounds mark. I've got only 22 sales for you today and the cutoff point was 8 quid uh, which means anything cheaper than that didn't make it to the video. There was plenty of 7.99 plus postage but if I wanted to include that 7.99 items that would be over 30 items in this video and that would be just too long. So yeah, let's have a look what exactly has sold last week. So last week, guys, meaning from Monday the 29th of May to Sunday the 4th of June, we have sold 47 items for a total of £541.64, which is very good. We had 13 orders in the bracket 5 to £10, including postage, 29 orders in the bracket 10 to £15, 3 orders in the bracket of 15 to 20 pounds, two orders over 20 pounds, including postage. Uh, no no multi-item orders last week, unfortunately. And we have sold 11 items via promoted listings, and it has costed us two pounds and 87 pence. In terms of weekly goals, we are read across the board. Uh, 11.52 average sale per item, uh, which is uh, a bit low. Uh, so our goal is 12 however like I said I've just started to push those prices up and uh, I'm still selling kind of lower uh, priced items so I have to kind of sell them first and it should pick up a bit uh, didn't list anything obviously 47 sold instead of 56 and 542 pounds taken instead of 590. So first item that has sold last week was this EV A-line skirt size 18 to 20. It was an auction. Customer came with eight pound offer and I have accepted it and she already, uh, she has left, she has left positive feedback for it. Uh, these MS trousers, uh, size 14, black with elastic waist, pockets. Uh, these have sold for £8.50 plus postage as an uh, offer to a watcher. This next corduroy jacket coat, size 22, in dusted pink. Uh, I had it for 24 99 Customer came with like 16 with offer or 15 something like that. I counted it with nineteen ninety nine, and she accepted it. <clears throat> this Bassini summer uh, t-shirt top it was size L, which worked out fourteen. This is sold for eight pounds. Uh, I've sent her an offer of eight fifty. She came back with eight, and I have accepted it. This, these next workwear trousers, they were size 16, navy in color, uh, 11 
but customer has applied coupon, 10% coupon on top of that, uh, and obviously postage as well. Uh, this French connection, summer A-line uh, dress, uh, this was size 12 only, uh, but 100% cotton. I had it for 14.99. Customer came with 11.44 offer, strange offer. And I said, you know what, it's only size 12 and I have accepted that offer and uh, she paid. This MS Summer t shirt, size 14, it has sold for full asking price $9.99, but customer applied 10% voucher, so quit off. Uh, these came, I believe, in the Tartan Hall. These were three maternity tops. I think two were a new look, and one was a red herring, or the other way around. Two were. An uh, yeah, two were red herring, one was new look. Red herring is a dude for me, really. And those maternity uh, clothes, that maternity clothing is a hit and miss. Sometimes it sells super quick, sometimes it doesn't sell at all. So I thought, let's bundle them together. And I put them at $14.99 and customer paid. Uh, $14.99, well, she paid a bit less because she applied coupon on top of that, so pound fifty off and 380 postage as well. Uh, this MS workwear trousers, they were only size 12, so I'm very happy to see them gone. Uh, $8.50 as an offer to a watcher plus postage on top. This Betty Jackson black tank top. Uh, it was size 18, it has sold for 8.99, a bit low, I wanted more, like you can see 11.99 I had it uh, listed for, but she was haggling so hard, I had enough of her, and yeah, I finally accepted that 8.99. And the sales also, at that point of the week, sales were super slow, so I just took that offer, basically. This Peruna, a boot on top, size 18, purple in color, quite nice, to be fair. Uh, this has sold for $9.99 as an offer to a watcher. Uh, this Bon Marsh t-shirt top, it was size 24, so good size. A customer bought it for $8.99, but she applied a uh, coupon on top of that, so 90 pence a discount. This Planet Trumpet skirt uh, was size 14, it still had a tag. Uh, this was on auction, $8.99, one bid, and she paid for it as well. This Sofia Mirza jumpsuit this came definitely in the haul well definitely 99 percent in the haul from tartan uh, it it had a tag but there was plenty marks a uh, plenty of marks uh, but those marks went off with a baby wipe so yeah i put it on offer is on auction that sofia mirza is a fast fashion brand uh, out of what I was able to gather from the internet uh, about this brand. So $9.99 on auction, one bid and sold. Uh, these, this lot of two Nike uh, activewear tops, they were size M, they were nothing cropped top tops and like sleeveless tops. Uh, I didn't find them like very appealing, so I bundled them together and put them at $19.99 and somebody has bought it for this price and postage on top of that. This uh, m and Workwear Cardigan Jumper, obviously all my winter items are in the freezer at the moment. I'm not having them listed, but this item was a return. And when I was listing all the returns, I've listed this item as well, this cardigan as well, and 
uh, I didn't realize I've done it, but I'm super happy because it has sold 9.99 plus postage and customer applied uh, 10% coupon again. This uh, next blouse, I had two of them. They both came in the last bail that you can watch uh, in my whole videos. And yeah, I've sold first of them for 850 as an offer to a watcher and one left of this. This new look strapless play suit, size 14. Uh, we had a tiny bidding war, three bids. I think I've started 699 or 799. And we've reached 10.55 plus postage on top. Super happy. Uh, this Peruna A-line midi dress, it was returned as well. So I put it a bit cheaper because I wanted to get rid of it quickly. Uh, 12.50 as an offer to a watcher. Quite a quick sale. This Zara button shirt, it was size large, so worked out 1416. Uh, this was on auction again. Well, sorry, 9.99, one bid, plus postage on top. Uh, this atmosphere shirt dress uh, was size 16, and because it was atmosphere, when customer came with eight pound offer, I have accepted it. This uh, MS A-Line Summer Mini Skirt, it was only size 12, so I'm very happy to sell it for 850 as an offer to a watcher with 380 postage on top of that. And the last item is this Eastex A-Line Workwear Mini Skirt size 18. Uh, it was on auction, 899 asking price, one bid, postage on top of that, and it has sold so how much have we earned uh, ebay has transferred us 362 pounds and 59 pence it is low because there was uh, there was a shop subscription payment last week and i had to refund those two returns that i've told you about uh, I think in last week video or maybe in some blogging videos basically I had two returns because my return ratio is so low I kind of expected them so I had them and I had to obviously uh, refund them uh, we've sold 47 items so setting aside uh, money for postage at £2.50 each that's, that gives us 170, uh, £117 and setting aside money to buy something new at one pound each that gives us 47 quid which gives us a profit of 199 pounds which considering there was a shop subscription payment which is almost 100 pounds at the moment now uh, that's uh, that's okay that's all right that's a good profit uh, we had sale on every single day of the week including that tuesday when we had one sale uh, just, just below 15 quid. That gives us uh, our counter, counting days since last zero sales day, day, and it's now on 155, which is bloody marvelous. So guys, like I've said in the intro, uh, I had a first non-payer since I've introduced my new method of pushing them to pay, which if you don't know, uh, what it is you can watch it over here it works magic to be fair uh, but obviously there must have been a point when somebody just wouldn't pay no matter what you say to them and what you write to them uh, and this last week uh, it was that time that point in time uh, she was dodgy straight from the beginning to be fair because I've sent her, a, when she made a bid, I've sent her a message on Wednesday uh, saying, look, I'm okay with the price. Do you want me to 
finish the uh, the auction and the auction and if you can pay on wednesday i will dispatch it on thursday and she never replied to me and they always do they always say yes yes please do that but she never replied to me so i knew right away this is gonna be a problem so when the auction has ended she was silent i've sent her my normal message like that message from this method and no she didn't reply so uh i've sent her another couple of messages i waited a week she didn't pay so i had to cancel the order uh yeah and that will be it guys for today uh, i hope you found this video interesting if you have please don't forget to click that like button also if you would like to support the channel further and you haven't subscribed yet please consider doing so uh, have a great week guys i'll see you next time god bless you all god bless people of ukraine and bye bye